An entire community wrapping their arms around a grieving family as they continue to search for answers. And the person who killed their loved one, 12 year old David Mack. Atlanta police say somebody knows something and they're pleading with people to come forward with information. It's not too late. David's family, friends and police canvassing the neighborhood yesterday in Southwest Atlanta, where David was found shot multiple times about two weeks ago, hoping to find new leads. Officers on foot, horseback and motorcycle spending hours knocking on doors and asking questions, all while the family distraught and heartbroken looks for closure. Joe Ripley joining us live now from outside Atlanta Police Headquarters with much more here. Joe, what have investigators found so far? They say they have some things in progress, some leads. That's right, Chief. Atlanta police homicide detectives say they do have some leads, though they're not confident in sharing those with the public at this point, but they're hoping one of those leads can help lead them to solve the big mystery this morning. Who shot and killed 12 year old David Mack and left him for dead in the woods there in southwest Atlanta? Well, that search continues this morning and on Thursday you mentioned police canvassing the neighborhood around Shirley Street. That's where David's body was found earlier this month. Police along with neighbors joining David's grieving, emotional and exhausted family spending hours going door to door, handing out pamphlets. Officers say they are making some progress. They have a witness who says David may have been with someone around the time he went missing. Right now, investigators are looking for anyone who might have seen him around three in the afternoon back on February 9th. The 12 year old's family believes someone has the info that can bring them closure. He called everybody. He kept in touch with everybody. So we're no longer going to get phone calls. He's no longer going to be able to check up on people. Because somebody took him from us. Atlanta Police Chief Rodney Bryan, as well as Atlanta City Council members, promised to continue dedicating resources to help find David's killer and bring uh, that family justice this morning. Uh, there is a $10,000 reward up for grabs for any information leading to an arrest. If you know anything in this case, you're urged to call Crime Stoppers.